I'm asking you to subscribe nicely. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Hey, you all have seen my stash. I have entirely too much stuff. A lot of that stuff I've never even opened. And another large portion of it is things that I couldn't tell you how they worked in my hair. One of those things being this Carol's Daughter Almond Milk Ultra Nourishing Hair Mask. I have used this before. I probably have one more full use from it. And I couldn't tell you how it worked in my hair. This product is a staple for the group chat. They forced me to go buy it. And honestly, when I tried it, I don't remember being blown away. <laughs> so I'm going to try it again today to see if it's going to be worth a repurchase. You all know that I love to damp condition. So I'm going to go in with this today. It says that it's for extremely damaged over processed hair Obviously that is not the case for me and my hair But this could be helpful to people that are experiencing damaged over processed hair This claims that it reverses damage deeply nourishes and protects against damage. I can see it protecting against damage I don't know so much about it reversing damage this is 12 ounces and it has almond milk, aloe butter, and shea oil as the key ingredients. It also boasts that it has no petrolatum, no mineral oil, and no artificial colors. Packaging says we damage our hair daily from flat ironing it to exposing it to harsh environmental aggressors. Start repairing broken overprocessed strands with this rich nourishing mask that reverses damage from the inside out so hair looks and feels softer and healthier for longer. Made with almond milk, aloe, and vitamins it also creates an invisible layer that protects against future damage make every day a healthy hair day I'm doing a quick once over of the ingredients and I'm almost positive there are silicones this does have silicones in it so if you do not use silicones obviously this won't be a good fit for you so like I said my hair is freshly cleansed and I did not wash it in sections. I just sectioned it so that way it'll be easier to apply the conditioner on camera. Flip these up and get my first section. My scalp feels so good. My hair just, just feels ready, you know, it just feels ready. So the directions say to massage gently into clean, wet hair, giving a little extra love to your frazzled ends. Leave on for five to seven minutes and then rinse well. I can already tell you now, I'm gonna have this on for longer than five to seven minutes because I just wanna get my money's worth. Tip, for an extra deep treatment, put on a shower cap and sit under a hood dryer for 10 to 15 minutes. This will help the nourishing ingredients get deep into your hair. So I'll probably do that, except I won't sit under a dryer. I'll probably just use my thermal cap. So this is the texture of it. It's actually very thick and creamy and it smells really good. This is going to tell my age, but this this smells like Jergens to me. It smells like old school Jergens hand lotion, that cherry almondy scent. I'm just going to slather this on, and I'm making sure I get this everywhere. Oh, this smells so good. <laughs> this is applying really, really well. So. As I've been teasing a lot on my community tab, I am really feeling like I wanna do a live stream. I don't feel like I should have to tell you all not to be psychotic or rude in the comments or asking things that are too private. I am trusting that you all know better than to cross any boundaries with the questions that you ask. So I don't feel like I need to say that. So yeah, let me know if you want me to go live. And please, if you like the video and comment and say that you want me to go live, please don't have me to sitting there talking to myself. I'm really enjoying how this is going on to my hair. Like, slip on this, considering how slightly thick the texture of this is, is really, really good. Like, look at that. My hair was not at all detangled. So of course I'll have links in the description box so that way you can look into this if you're interested. Honestly, y'all, uh, I need to use up this stuff. So, <laughs> you all will be seeing a lot of videos with me using things that I already have. Obviously, I'm going to be buying new things because I have a problem and I can't help myself. But I have so many gems in my stash and I want to share them with you all. I know a lot of people have just kind of like given up on Carol's Daughter. I remember when Carol's Daughter just used to be like the standard. Like when it was all over 
HSN or QVC, whatever it was. We used to love us some Carol's daughter. I guess y'all just won't win it no more after she sold to L'Oreal, I think it was. I know with the acquisition and the formula changes, etc., etc., that a lot of people have just kind of written Carol's daughter off, but I have to tell you, this, the Coco Creme, and the Goddess Strength Collection, love it so much. Like I said, I only had a use left, so obviously I finished the jar, which we love to see because hashtag usual stash. So far, so good. The application of that was fantastic. Slip was good and really distributed through my hair really well. So now I'm going to go ahead and cover my hair with my plastic cap and then sit under my thermal cap for about 15 minutes, rinse, and then I'll come back with my final thoughts. All right, rinsed the deep conditioner and Ugh. Love this for me. Ugh. And as usual, scent is kind of lingering, but it's pleasant to me, so it's not really bothering me. You see it? Okay, so I just put my hair back up so we can go ahead and wrap up this video. I love this. I don't know what was going on with my hair the first time I tried this and why it wasn't a memorable experience for me, but this, a staple. Hands down. The application, fantastic. The slip, outstanding. The softness in my hair, phenomenal. So know that the next time I see this in TJ Maxx, Marshalls, or if there's a sale at Sally's, I'll definitely be picking this up. I know a number of you will feel a way about this because there are silicones and you have every right to feel that way. I'm just sharing my experience with it and if silicones don't work for you, okay. Be sure to drop in the comments and let me know if you've tried this. And if you haven't tried it, let me know if you're going to or let me know where's your deep conditioning with this week for your wash day. Also make sure you leave some likes and some questions for me if you want me to go live this weekend. I'm scared, but I think I'm gonna go through with it. Also, before I forget, thank you all so, 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 so much for 7K. We just, we just keep growing out here. Thank you so, so much. I don't want to get misty. Lastly, be sure that you like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so, so much for watching. Please be safe, and I'll catch you in the next one.